We've added in a desk to the equation down here in Lewiston as we've expanded the set. We'll also add in outside linebackers coach Roy Manning, and we'll talk to potential starting nickelback Hunter Dale, and as always, the head man himself, Mike Leach. We've got the pads on once again down here in the Valley in Lewiston talking fall camp. Who's your crew this year, Coach? Who are your boys? Oh, man. Confirm for I got, us. I got a big crew for you. Uh, Dylan Hanzer, Frankie Louvu, uh, uh, Chima. Uh, I can't pronounce his last name. I just call him Chima by his first name. Mason Vineyard, Greg Hoy, uh, and that's at the rush position. Also, Willie Taylor, Young Buck. And then at the nickel position, Kirkman Parker, Hunter Dale, Dylan Axelson, uh, Diamond Richardson, and then some other young guys, Cole DeBots and uh, Damian Lee. So, How do you see the nickel playing out? Shalom's moved on to the NFL, yeah. key spot in the defense. Yeah. We talked about it a little bit just now with Diamond. He's a bigger guy. How do you think that works itself out? Who, who are the front runners right now? Well, you know, obviously uh, Hunter Dale, you know, had the most experience coming out of spring ball, and Diamond is new to the position as well as Kirkland, who played it some in previous years. So he's getting back into it now. And I tell you what, those guys are really competing. They're doing a really good job. And, and, and I really probably since I've been here, it's been the best competition at that position. And, and yeah, we have big shoes to fill in Shalom, but I'm confident that those guys will emerge and, and, uh, and they're doing a heck of a job. Here with junior defensive back Hunter Dale as you have the pads on today. Did you have the play of the day today? Was that interception? You had a diving pick. <laughs> Probably was the play of the day. Um, yeah, that's always a good play to get the ball back into our offense's hands so a turnover for the defense. But um, there's, there's plays out there that people don't really see that are huge too. But uh, obviously turnover is always big. What's the stuff out there that people don't see, that don't have statistics that you feel like you did well today? Um, people doing their job, like leveraging a block and somebody else getting a tackle. Nobody sees that. They just see the person that gets the tackle. Um, also, somebody just uh, completely locking somebody down to where the quarterback can't even pass it to him. And then he has to scramble and he throws it somewhere else. They don't even see that type of stuff. And that's big plays for us. What makes a good nickelback in this system? What have you talked to Alex Grinch about making a good nickel here for this Cougar day? Um, it's all about technique and also run fits. You got to know your run fits and also your pass on each play because they could do a run or a pass, and you got to see your your guard for uh, run pass keys. Coach, let's talk about how the defense played today. They won the team drill in terms of the way you keep score, but how do you think they actually played? Uh, I thought they played good. We're still kind of streaky. Uh, I think. Uh, Offensively and defensively, we're still streaky, and, and we'd like to see the streaks even out. As far as cumulative plays, I think you know both sides are making plays, and they make plays. Um, but I would like to see either side uh, react quicker. Once one guy makes a play, then react and uh, and, and respond to it, you know. And uh, but you know we've got quite a bit of flash and explosion out there on both sides of the ball, and I think that part's really good.